strength for clouds, settle down on the mats. Relaxing in Shavasana, arms apart and the legs apart. Let the feet relax to the sides, turn the palms up towards the ceiling. Arms are six to eight inches away from the body. Shavasana, Shavasana. Chin close to the chest. And now begin to relax the body. Relax the feet. Relax the legs. Relax the back. Relax the arms and the shoulders. Relax the neck, head and the face. Watch your mind. Let go of the thoughts. Connecting with the breath. Breathe slowly, breathe deeply. Every inhalation, the abdomen expands. And every exhalation, the abdomen contracts. Breathe with full awareness. Slowly bring your legs together, interlock your fingers and stretch your arms over the head. Give a nice stretch to your body, stretch your whole body, release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn over to one side and place it up for the prayer. Sit up straight, close your eyes. Ya
शांति 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 ओम श्राय वेलकम टू द क्लास लेट्स गेट रेडी फॉर द प्रैक्टिस sitting up tall and straight hands on the knees in chain mudra preparing for the kapalabhati take two deep breaths in here exhale inhale exhale focus on the abdomen take a deep breath in here and begin Slowly, we we'll control. Exhale. Inhale. Lift the energy up. And exhale. Relax the body. Now get ready for the next round of Kapalabhati. All the awareness to your abdomen. Back straight. Shoulders roll back. Inhale deeply. And begin. One two. One two. One two. One two. One two. One two. Thank you. 
Take a deep breath. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Now to hold the breath. Inhale. A deep, comfortable breath. Hold the breath gently. Focus at the third eye center. Any discomfort any time, please release the breath and take normal breaths. Slowly with control, exhale. Take a deep breath, inhale. Exhale. Now adjust your body. If you need to stretch the legs, then only you do that. Roll the toes clockwise and anti-clockwise if the legs are stretched out. And when you're ready, please recross the legs. Preparing for the alternate task for breathing. Right hand in Vishnu Mudra. Left hand in Chin Mudra. Arms turned up, hands on the knees. Roll the shoulders back and down and lift yourself up from the base of the spine. Through both the nostrils, inhale deeply. Exhale completely. Inhale. And exhale. Block the right nostril with your right thumb. Left inhale. On one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath. Close the nostrils. Right exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four. Gently hold, close nostrils. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the breath, close the nostrils. A gentle breath retention. Do not tense any part of your body. <clears throat> Keep the awareness at the third eye center. Right exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath, close the nostrils. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, retain the breath. Right exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath very gently. Relax the body. Relax the mind. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, hold, close the nostrils. Right exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the breath, relax the face, all the facial muscles, soften the eyes, the forehead, 
Relax the top of the head, the back of the head, the neck muscles, the shoulders. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the breath, close the nostrils. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four, on hold. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, gently hold, close the nostrils, back straight, shoulders roll back, chin parallel to the mat. To the right, exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four, hold. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Retain the last round. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, hold the breath, last retention. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, bring the hand down, hands on the knees in chin mudra. Stay here, relax the body, keep the eyes closed, normal gentle breathing. Now keeping the eyes closed, please stretch the legs and lie down, Shavasan. Take rest, relax. Take a deep breath, slowly bring your legs together, interlock your fingers and give a nice stretch to your body, stretch your whole body, stretch, stretch and release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn to one side, please sit up and stand up, sun salutation. Get ready for the first round. Feet together, inhale. As you exhale, join the hands to the chest in prayer. Inhale, stretch the arms up along the ears and arch back, look up. Exhale, stretch the body forward and reach down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back into the plank, body in a straight line. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back into cobra. Exhale, tuck the toes in, inverted knee, look to the toes. Inhale, bring your right leg forward, right foot between the hands, left knee down, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward, 
Shift the body weight forward, press the hands down. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back. Push the body forward, look up. Exhale, release. Left side, inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and reach down. Inhale, the left leg back, left knee down, push pointing knee back and look up. Hold the breath, take the right leg back, body in a straight line, back is straight, abdomen pulled in. Exhale, knees down, chest in the forward down, eight parts touching down. Inhale, slide forward, arch back into cobra, shoulders relax. Exhale, inverted V, look the toes in, lift your buttocks up, look to the toes. Press the hands down, press the heels down. Inhale, bring your left leg forward, left foot between the hands, right knee down, toes pointing back, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward, press the hands down, chest close to the thighs, forehead close to the knees. Inhale, stretch forward and reach up. Pull the waist up and push the buttocks forward. Don't drop the head back, head in line with the arms, look up. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, join the hands to the chest in prayer. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, bring your right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, join the palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg all the way back. Look up, hold the breath, take the left leg back, plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Stay here, push the heels more down. Press the hands more down. Head in line with the arms, push the chest down. And pull the abdomen in, stay and breathe. Now, as you inhale, bring your right leg forward, right foot between the hands. Exhale, the left leg forward. Shift the body weight forward. Stay here, breathe. Bring the chest close to the thighs, hold it close to the knees. Keep breathing. Now, as you inhale, stretch forward and reach up. Elbow straight, knees straight, head in line with the arms. Push the buttocks forward without dropping the head, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Left side, inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms apart back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back all the way, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back. Hold the plank pose, stay here for five counts. One, two, three, four, five. Slowly exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. 
Inhale, stretch your body forward, reach up and arch back, look up and exhale, release. Going a little faster for the next three rounds. Inhale and exhale, join the palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the whole it down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch your body forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. And exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, join the palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, arms apart back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. And exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms apart, back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. And exhale, release. Last round, right side. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms to arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward, look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back, look up. And exhale, release. Left side, inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms to arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back and look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward and reach up, arch back. Look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Please sit down and lie down. Relax on your back in Shavasana. Arms apart and the legs apart, relax. Slow down the breath. Absorb all the warmth, the heat, the energy that you've just created with this practice. So let the body relax down with gravity. Do not resist gravity.
Slowly bring the legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head, stretch your whole body, stretch and release the stretch. Get ready for the single leg raises, place the arms close to the body with palms facing down, move the shoulders down, bring the chin closer to the chest, feet together, toes pointing up. Work with your abdomen as you inhale, raise your right leg up. Knees straight, toes fold in. Exhale, push the heel out and bring the right leg down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale, bring the leg down. Right leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Left leg up, inhale. Press the load back. Exhale down. Right leg up, inhale. Hold the right thigh with both your hands and bring the leg closer towards the body. Now as you exhale, raise the head up, chest up, walk the hands up towards the ankle and come up. Tuck the toes in, all 10 toes pointing towards the head. The sole of the right foot should be facing up. Relax the shoulders by bending the elbows, keep the chest open and feel a good soothing pressure on the lower back. Every exhalation, contract the abdomen, allow the leg to come more in and push the left thigh more down. Slowly, as you exhale, place the head and chest down and bend the right knee close to the chest, hug it tightly. Now prepare for the Supta Masindrasana or the reclining spinal twist. Stretch your right arm in line with the right shoulder. Keep going with the instruction and hold the right outside of the right knee with your left hand. On the exhalation, bring the right knee down to the left side. Turn the head to the right. Press the right shoulder nicely down. And you can put the right foot either behind the left thigh or place it ahead of the left leg on the mat. Just relax the body and take a few slow, long and deep breaths. Inhale, slowly come up. Exhale, hug the knee close to the chest. Now release the arms. Inhale, raise the right leg up. And with control, exhale, bring it down. Take the left leg up, inhale. Hold the thigh with both your hands and pull the leg closer. On the exhalation, raise the head up, chest up and come up. Hands more up towards the ankle. Tuck the toes in, knees straight. Relax the body, close your eyes and take a few slow, long and deep breaths, focusing on the lower back. Keep pulling the toes in, don't lose the stretch in the hamstrings. Keep the knees straight. Slowly exhale, place the head and chest down, bend the left knee close to the chest and hug it. Now for the Supta stretch your left arm in line with the shoulder. Hold the outside of the left knee with your right hand. On the exhalation, bring the left knee down to the right. Adjust the position of the left foot and press the left shoulder completely down. Breathe, relax, hold. Slowly, as you inhale, come back up. Exhale, hug the knee to the chest. Now release the arms. Inhale, raise the left leg. Exhale, with control, bring it down. Now get ready for the double leg raises. If you have a troublesome back or a lower weak back, uh, weak back, please slide the arms under the body. Or you can keep the arms close to the body, palms down. Or tuck the hands under the head. Or stretch the arms over the head. You want to challenge yourself. Feet together, toes pointing up, work with your abdomen. Inhale, raise both your legs up. With control, exhale, bring the legs down, close to the mat. Inhale, come up. We'll do this six times. Exhale, down. 
Third time, inhale up. Exhale, you control, bring the legs down. Fourth time, up, inhale. Exhale down. Five, up, inhale. Exhale down. One more time, inhale, raise the legs up. And now, uh, stretch your arms in line with the shoulders, wherever your arms are, palms facing down. Bring the legs a little closer towards the head. On the exhalation, bring the legs down to the right side. Lower the legs to the right. And turn the head to the left. Left shoulder grounded. Try to move the legs more up. Either hold the uh, outside of the left thigh with the right hand and pull the legs up or hold the toes if you're more flexible. Stay breathe. Relax the right shoulder down, right elbow down. Now, keeping the legs together and knees straight, raise the legs all the way up, inhale. Bring the legs a little closer towards the head and on the exhalation, lower the legs to the left, down the head to the right. That's very good. Hold the toes or hold the outside of the thigh. Keep the right shoulder uh, pressing down. Breathe. Now slowly take your time, raise the legs up, inhale. And with control, exhale, bring the legs down. Now give a long stretch to your body. Arms over the head, interlock your fingers, stretch the body. Stretch. Release the stretch, bend the knees, turn over to one side. Please sit up and relax into the child's pose. Mm -hmm. Preparing for the headstand, Shishwasan. Breathe and relax. And slowly sit up on the heels. Let's follow the steps. Hold the opposite elbows. Place the forearms down. Interlock your fingers. Now place the top of the head down and back of the head against the hands. Tap the toes in, lift the knees up and walk forward till the back becomes straight. Bend the knees one by one all together to the chest. And when you're ready, move the knees up and straighten the legs up into the head stand. Very good. Breathe, relax. Keep the abdomen holding, don't arch the back. Relax your legs. If you're touching the feet on the wall, please re release one heel off the wall and straighten your body. The back shouldn't arch as you hold the posture. That's very good. Let's follow the steps and come out. Bend the knees, bring the knees close to the chest and bring the feet down. Relax into the child's pose.
Now please sit up and lie down on Chavasu. Turn the head side to side. Relax. Take a deep breath. Bring your legs together. Interlock your fingers and stretch your arms up. Stretch in your whole body. Release the stretch. Get ready for Sarvangasana or the shoulder stand. Arms close to the body. Palms facing down. Feet together. Toes pointing up. Open the shoulders down and bring the tail up to the, close to the chest. Inhale. Raise the legs up. Exhale. Swing the trunk up. Support your back and come up into the shoulder stand. Now adjust your body to straighten the back more. You can bend the knees to the forehead, draw the elbows closer, hands more down towards the middle back, and then straighten the legs up. Shift the body weight to the shoulders and relax each part of your legs. Close your eyes and be still for some time. Focus on the throat region. Locking plenty of blood in the throat, stimulating the thyroid and the parathyroid glands, giving rest to the heart, to the lungs with its inversion, giving rest to the legs. Now lengthen up your body as you inhale and on the exhalation with control bring the right leg over the head. That's very good. Inhale the right leg up. Exhale the left leg over the head. Inhale the left leg up. One more time. Exhale right leg down. Inhale the right leg up. Exhale the left leg down. Inhale the left leg up. Adjust your body for the plow pose. On the exhalation, bring both the legs down with control. Legs over the head. Once the toes touch the floor, you can release the hand support. Stretch your arms on the mat. Stay and breathe. Keep the knees pushed away from the forehead and still the body for the next 30 seconds. Focus on the breath. Keep the tailbone lifted up. Now, Place the arms on the mat, lift the feet off the floor and one vertebra at a time. Please come down. Use your arms as breaks, there is no hurry. Very good. Once you're down, turn the head side to side. And now get ready for Setu Bandhasan. Bend the knees and hold your ankles. 
theta hip width apart, not wider, not wider than the hip width. Inhale, lift your buttocks up and come up. Lift up higher, make your thighs parallel to the mat. Chest close to the chin. Once again, working on the thyroid gland by creating that lock, the chin lock. Hold here, breathe. And slowly exhale, come down. Chakrasan, place the hands under the shoulders. Turn the fingers in. Heels close to the buttocks. As you inhale, lift your buttocks up, press the hands and come up. Press the hands more down, straighten the elbows. Hold here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one, and slowly come down. Hug the knees close to the chest. Press the load back down. And on the exhalation, lift your head up, chest up, and come up. Stretch your chin, nose, or forehead towards the knee. Don't hunch the shoulders. Release the shoulders down. Relax. Breathe. Slowly exhale, place the head down, release the arms, stretch your legs up, inhale, and with control, exhale, bring the legs down. Matsyasana, the fish pose, slide the arms under the body, shoulder blades together, elbows closely in. Head up, chest up, inhale, come up, look at the toes. As you exhale, lift your chest up, arch your back, and bring the top of the head down. So there is no much pressure on the head, remember this. Keep pressing on the elbows to reduce the pressure on the neck and the head. Slow down the breathing. Make your inhalations long and your exhalations even longer. Slowly inhale, come up, head up, chest up, and exhale, bring the body down. Release the arms from under the body. Make fist and rotate the wrist clockwise and then clockwise. Turn the head side to side. Relax in Shavasana. Take a deep breath. Bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, and give a nice stretch to your body, arms and the head. Stretch your whole body. Release the stretch. And please sit up. Join the soles together, the back straight, hold the toes and tap the knees. Now, move your feet a little forward, a few inches away from the body. No, no, bend the knees, keep the soles together, yeah, for the forward bend. Now, hold the toes, or maybe you can stretch the arms up as you inhale. As you exhale from the lower back, stretch your body forward and come down. So you can place the hands either on the mat ahead of the feet or hold the toes. Very good. Try to put the head down on the feet and keep working on the inner thighs to push the knees more down. As you push the knees more down, the body extends and come down, comes down.
Make an effort to bring the knees more down. Slowly inhale, come up. Release the posture, spread in the legs for Pashimutanasana. Lengthen your body. Inhale, raise the arms up and stretch up. As you exhale from the lower back, stretch forward and come down. Hold the toes. Relax the shoulders by bending the elbows. Every exhalation, try to contract the abdomen and let the body come down. With the inhalation, lengthen your spine and stretch more forward. Slowly stretch forward and come up. Exhale, place the hands behind. Lower the head back. For the counter stretch, lift your buttocks up and come up. Place the feet down. Lift up higher. Very good. Hold here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one and slowly come down. Now relax on your abdomen. Let's get ready for the backward bends. Make a pillow with your hands. Turn the head to the right. Big toes touch together. Heels apart. Relax the shoulders. Relax the shoulder blades. The chest down on the mat. Take a few conscious breaths. With the inhalation, feel the abdomen expand against the mat. And with the exhalation, let the body just sink down. Now, preparing for Bhujangasan. Place the forehead down, tuck the elbows close to the chest, fingertips in line with the shoulders. Elbows should be pointing up, feet together, toes pointing back. As you inhale, raise the head up, chest up, and come up. Relax the shoulders. Away from the ears, keep the elbows sticking to the chest. Stay up and breathe. Slowly, as you exhale, bring the head down, come down. Keep holding the posture here. Take a breath and move the hands more down towards the waist or under the ribcage. Separate the legs, hip width apart. Preparation for Purna Bhujangasana. Now, as you inhale, lift your head up, chest up. Straighten the arms, lift the abdomen up. Come up more. Stay up, very good. Drop the head back and push the pelvis down. Drop the head back. Very good. Hold it, don't bend the elbows. Breathe. Now center the head and on the exhalation, turn the body to the right, twist to the right. Keep the elbows straight. Look to the left knee. Inhale, come back to the center. Exhale, turn the head. Sorry, twist the body to the left and turn the head to look to the right heel. Inhale, come back to the center. As you exhale, bend the elbows and come down. Now turn the head to the left and relax. Big toes touch together, heels apart.
Now get ready for Shalabhasan. Stretch your chin forward, bring your arms under the body. You can interlock the fingers, make fist of your hands or place the hands down. But keep the elbows nicely hidden under the body. Watch it. If the elbows are closer, you get a better lift in the legs. Chin forward. As you inhale, stretch the right leg back and lift it up. Exhale down, the palms down, not up. Inhale, the left leg up. Exhale down. Inhale, the right leg up. Bend the left knee. Support the right thigh with the left foot. Place the palms on the mat, down, facing down. Yeah. Slowly release the support and bring the right leg down as you exhale. Left leg up, inhale. Support the left thigh with your right foot. Hold the posture. Breathe. Slowly release the support, exhale, bring the leg down. Adjust your body for the full posture, locus, chalabhasana. Take two breaths, recharge the body. Bring the elbows hidden under the body. If the elbows are outside, then it's not possible to lift the legs up higher. Now get ready. As you inhale, lift both your legs up and come up. Chin on the mat. Very good. Breathe. Holding 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and slowly come down. Rest with head to one side and relax with big toes touching, heels apart. Dhanur Asan, the bow pose. Pour it down, bend the knees and hold your ankles. As you inhale, lift your knees up, thighs up, head up, chest up and come up. Pull the body up on the soft part of your abdomen, reveal your elbows straight. Chin, up, chin more up, close your eyes and relax the face. Pull the thighs more up, chest more up. Ideally, the pelvic bones and the drip case should be off the mat. Hold your 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and slowly come down. Now, place the hands under the shoulders, give yourself a good stretch. Come up on the knees and the hands. Matriyasan. Align the body first. Now inhale, push the hip back, arch your back and stretch the chin forward. Exhale, round your back, tuck the chin in, tuck the abdomen in. One more time, inhale, push the hip back, arch your back and stretch the chin forward. Exhale, round the back, tuck the chin in, tuck the abdomen in. Come back to the neutral position and get ready for the camel pose, the last backward bend. Stand up on the knees, feet and knees, hip width apart. Ustrasan, the camel. Come up on the knees. Go with the instruction. Now raise the right arm up. Inhale. As you exhale, arch your back and try to hold the right ankle with your right hand. Same way with the left side. Stretch your left arm up. Inhale. As you exhale, hold the ankle. Now drop the head back and push your buttocks forward. Align the thighs. Perpendicular to the floor. Very good. Breathe. Five. Hold it. Four. Three. Two. And one. Slowly raise the right arm and the left arm. Come up. Uh, come out of the posture. Relax into the child's pose. Make it wide angle, extended child's pose. Okay, the balasan. Separate the knees nicely apart. Big toes touching, heels fall apart, sit between the heels. Extend the arms forward and bring the chest down. Try to separate the knees wider so that the chest can come down more. Very good. Chin or the forehead down. 
It's just like making an effort and being there. So if you don't use your body, you never increase your limit. Taking your own time, please slowly come up. Join the knees together, get ready for the half spinal and twist. Sit down on the right side of your body and bring the left foot across the right thigh. Place the left hand behind near the tailbone. Stretch your right arm up, inhale, lengthen up the body. As you exhale, twist your body to the left. Push the outside of the left knee with your upper right arm to hold the ankle. That's very good. Look to the left shoulder. Keep the back straight and the left hand closer towards the tailbone, towards the body. That's how your body will twist. If you keep the hand in front, that's not going to help much. So try to move the left hand towards the right side. Then you feel a better twist. Keep breathing. Ravindra, you just hug the knee and twist your body. You don't have to hold the ankle as of now. Just hug the knee and twist. Slowly, as you inhale, raise the right arm up. And exhale, release it down. Face the side, sitting to the left side of your body. Bring the right foot across the left thigh. Place the right hand close to the tailbone. Left arm up, inhale. As you exhale, twist your body to the right. Push the outside of the right knee with your upper left arm. Hold the ankle and look to the right shoulder. Keep the back straight. Both the sitting bones on the mat and knee close to the body. Relax, keep the back straight and hold the posture. Slowly, as you inhale, stretch your left arm up and exhale, bring the arm down, hug the knees close to the chest, sit up straight, rest with your forehead to the knees and relax. Now release the posture, let's get ready for balancing pose, crow, kakasana. So first come up into the squatting position and then make a rough square with your hands and the feet. Rest your knees on the upper arms. Look at a point in front. Now lift your buttocks up and transfer the body weight from feet to the hands. Just try. Very good. Hold as long as you can. Excellent. Please release and stand up. Stand in forward bend. Bring your feet together. Come to the front of the mat. Inhale. Raise the arms up along the ears. Lengthen up the body. As you exhale, stretch your body forward. Must reach forward to the wall and then come down to hold the ankles or anywhere behind the legs. Shift the body weight forward towards the toes and keep the toes relaxed and separated. Chest close to the thighs, folded close to the knees, top of the head reaching down. Keep the knees straight. Stay and breathe. Now soften the knees, dangle the arms loose, one vertebra at a time. Release the posture, come up. Let's keep a counter stretch to the body. Separate the feet, hip width apart. Support your back, lower the head back and push the hip forward. Take two breaths here. 
So when you come up in here and release the parcel, exhale. Now use the length of the mat and get ready for three cone asana. Separate your feet apart, legs apart, three to four feet. Turn the right foot to the right, just a little more apart. That's good. Turn the left foot in. Uh, sorry, the right foot. Uh -huh, left foot in. Now the hip should be facing forward and stretch your left arm up as you inhale. Lengthen up the left side, relax the right shoulder down. On the exhalation, bend down to the right. Look in front or look up. Let the right hand slide down the leg. Very good. Push the chest open and let's try to move the right vertebra a little forward so that the hip doesn't twist and you get a better stretch in the left side. Hold and breathe. Now, bend the right knee and place the right elbow on the right thigh. Bend the right knee, place the right elbow on the right thigh. Raj, we watch here. This is the way we are doing. Let's keep doing, watch it from there itself. Stay and breathe. Now inhale, slowly come up. And exhale, bring the arm down. Feet aside, turn the left foot out and the right foot in. Inhale, stretch your right arm up. Lengthen up the body. Separate the legs more gradually. On the exhalation, bend down to the left side. Look in front, look up, whichever way your head is comfortable. Very good. Hold and breathe. Now, bend the left knee and place the left elbow on the left thigh. Very good. Stretch the right side more. Keep breathing. Feel a good stretch from the edge of the right foot to the fingertips of the right hand. And don't break the energy on the wrist or the elbow. Keep the body straight. Inhale, slowly come up. And exhale, bring the arm down. Turn the legs together. Time for final relaxation. Please come forward on the mat and sit down. Lie down, relax on your back and chavasana. Slow down the breathing. Now let's tense the body parts. Raise the Right leg pointes off the mat, tense the leg, tense it and drop it down. Left leg pointes up, tense the leg, tense the leg and drop it down. Lift both your legs up, tense the legs, tense the legs and drop. Now tense the buttocks, lift them off the mat, tense, tense and release. Press the small of the back to the mat, let go. Lift your chest up, up and drop it down. Squeeze the shoulders into the ears. Push the shoulders down. Lift your arms two inches up. Clench the fingers tight. Tight. Open the fingers. Tense your arms. Tense. Tense and release. Now make a tight face. Lemony face. Tight. Tight. Release. Let go. Open the mouth. Stretch your tongue out. Open the eyes wide. Look to the forehead and stretch your face. Stretch. Stretch and release. Close the mouth. Put the shoulders more down, turn the head to the right and turn the head to the left. Back to the center, make any adjustment you have to, to feel more relaxed in the body. Palms six to eight inches away from the body, the palms stand up, chin close to the chest, shoulders away from the ears, feet relaxed to the sides, with legs comfortably apart. Mentally, relax the toes, the soles, the heels and the ankles. Relax the shins and the calves. Now 
relax the knees and the thighs. Relax the buttocks, relax the hip joint. Feel a good relaxation to the legs. And let this relaxation touch the abdomen and the chest. Relaxing the abdominal muscles, the chest muscle, all the abdominal organs. Relax the lungs, relax the heart. Bring the awareness to your back. Relax the lower back, middle back, upper back. Relax the spinal column. Feel a good relaxation to the back. Let the back sink down, relax down with gravity. Focus on the arms. Relax the fingers, the palms, the wrists. Relax the forearms. The elbows, the upper arms. Relax the shoulders, the neck, the back of the head, the top of the head, the forehead, the eyes, the nostrils, the cheekbones. Relax the ears, the jaw, the tongue, the toe, the mouth. Feel a good relaxation with the arms, shoulders, neck, head, and the face. Now become aware of your thoughts, of your mind. Let go completely in the mind. Relax the mind. Relax the mind. Say to yourself, I am completely relaxed. Relax. Relax. Relax.
Bring the awareness back to the body. Move your toes, move the fingers, shake out the legs and the arms, turn the head side to side. Keep a deep conscious breath, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers and stretch your arms up. Final gentle stretch to the body, stretch and release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn over to one side. Please sit up for the final prayer. Thanks to our teachers, Hari Om Thank you, everyone.